Hello, welcome back to another video here at Making Moose Creations. So today we're going to be doing another scrapbooking spread. So this theme is going to be uh, vintage. So I've got my things um, all sorted into a pile and I'm just going to start placing them around. So some of these I've been like saving for quite a long time. Um, I like to receive all different things in mail so some of the things aren't necessarily always vintage but I do have a couple of these uh, vintage book pages I'm gonna cut them up so that they fit where I want them to go but I think I'm gonna Take some more of that off. Cut it up like so. Put that at the top. And I've got some more here. I might. No, it's too big to use as just. In the sheet because I don't really have anything to put over it so if I stick these like this <clears throat> then I have plenty more things to put around and decorate so that's kind of taken up the bulk of the page so I'm just going to place these items around. I also have some washi tape that I'm going to be using. Oops. Can't get the washi off, so let's try again. I'm gonna fill this gap with that. I'm gonna put those down there. I have this. And over here, I think I'm gonna stick this violin or musical theme. Um, I do have a little envelope. pieces are quite lovely I've got quite a lot more vintage stuff uh, themed things than I thought I did which is obviously <laughs> rather nice. So this is coming along rather well.
okay so I'm quite happy with that so I'm gonna start sticking down what I can and just start building up our page until everything is in place really Okay, so this is coming along very nicely, I've nearly filled this scrapbook as well now, so I'm hoping that it won't be too much longer until it is fully finished, and that'd be really cool, because yeah, that'd be my second pen pal scrapbook that I've finished. And that would just be amazing because I absolutely love everything that everybody sends to me. I'm so grateful that I get to keep it. I've also been making some more um, pen pal mail on my YouTube channel. So you can flip through all the videos and just see what's up. See if there's anything on there that you fancy watching because because this is for making education and, and we're a small business we also do uh, flip throughs of what's on our red bubble site we put up what is on our etsy and we make wax seal videos, polymer clay videos, we do all the scrapbooking and the pen piling. Sometimes I do resin, so have a little look and see if there's anything else that you fancy watching. We really appreciate all the views and likes and comments that we get. And we thank you so much. I say we, it's, it's mostly just me. I have some help sometimes from my family, but I love what I do. It gives me a sense of relaxation to just craft and do whatever, especially when I'm studying most of the time. It just gives me something to focus on and just take my mind off everything else and so that's what I've been doing over the past couple of days because I've filmed quite a few videos all in one go um, so I hope you guys don't mind but it's just much easier for me if I do it that way only because I had an exam and then I did my exam, it was a very stressful exam, but I got through it, so I'm rewarding myself with some craft time before I get back into uni, and currently I'm still at home, so I have all my craft supplies here, and then when I go back to uni I won't be able to craft as much, because I'll leave most of my craft supplies behind, because I can't really take them all up there. And so I like to do as much as I can while I'm at home so that when I go back to uni I've got some a stash of stuff that I'll be able to 
upload as and when for you guys. But if you want more access to what we do, you can find us on Facebook and Instagram as well. I also have a blog where you can see uh, how I make things but in like written instructions and things like that so that might be helpful I haven't really been writing on there a lot lately only because I have been so busy and I also have Megan Jane's Adventures on YouTube and other places on the internet and me and my boyfriend have Eminem Animal Adventures so if you like animals and you like photography go and check us out we're actually um, it's going to be on the 20th of January that we go but I don't know when this video will go up but on the 20th of January we are going to be going up London, we're going to the zoo we're going to go and see the Sumatran tiger cub or attempt to see the Sumatran tiger cub but hopefully we'll just have an all round grand day and we will be doing some YouTube videos on that so if you want to see what it's like at London Zoo you can go over there and watch our videos on I'll do one on M and, uh, Meg and Jane's adventures and Michael will do one on Eminem animal adventures but he'll probably use some of my videos anyway because he always steals them nah he's allowed to I guess. Bless him. But no, I've done something wrong here and I can't quite figure out what it is that I've managed to change. But they seem to fit better there. Maybe I'll put him down there. Just need one more thing now to fill in this little gap down here. Maybe I'll add in this little postage stamp. And see if we have a little flower. Actually, I'm not going to overcrowd it. Oh no, the rubbish men are coming. So I'm going to leave it here. So I'm back. It got really noisy for a second because, as I said, the bin men were coming through. But I realised that you couldn't hear me. So I stopped for a second. But these are my finished pages. I'm really happy with how they turned out. I think they're really cute. And hopefully with the remaining supplies that I've got I'll still be able to get another couple of pages so I'll do that in another video all that's left to say is thank you for watching this video if you liked it please give it a thumbs up for more content like this give us a subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye